you're watching Backyard Tech. G'day everyone, thank you for tuning in Friday morning up here in Bendigo. And uh, I've got a few projects on the cards for today. <laughs> so I'm going to try and edit these today and upload them tonight, but if it doesn't all go to plan, I will upload them when I get home. So the projects I've got on for today, this is the other half's father's laptop. This is one of my, I gave this to him. This is an Extensa 5620 MX18 is on this one. So not 18.2, but 18. And it's not happy. There is something wrong with this laptop. Um, I'm not sure whether it's OS related or hardware related. I've got to look into that. It is ridiculously slow to boot. Funnily enough, this thing actually boots a lot slower than this laptop with Windows. You might find that a bit hard to believe. So I've got to figure out what this is. This has got an Intel Centrino mobile inside. It's basically the same as my 5630 extensor, but it's Intel Centrino instead of Intel Core 2 Duo. The 5620s came out with Centrino and I think low-end Intel Core 2 Duo. The 5630s came out with Intel Core 2 Duos in them. I've never seen a 5630 with a Centrino in it. Something's wrong with this. I've got to look into it. It's giving him the irrits. This is the other laptop that I've got to work on. This is the one I'm still waiting for from permission from the organization to show you the second part of this job. There is something horribly wrong with uh, not necessarily the laptop, but the way this thing talks to the projection device, I guess is the best way of describing the problem with this. This is a Toshiba satellite with an Intel uh, Celeron in it, uh, two gig of RAM, and is used for projection purposes, shall we say, without going into too many details. But this thing's not happy. Um, so what I'm doing with this is standard Windows maintenance. I'm gonna run all the updates, um, and then I've got to tomorrow take it back to where it is used, tomorrow being Saturday, and fix the problem. But I haven't got permission yet to show you guys um, the problem. So I'm still waiting on that. I'm not guaranteeing permission just because of the organization, but at least I can show you what else I've got. So two laptops. I've got the side off the other half's father's main PC, or her parents' main PC, I should say, because her mum doesn't use the laptop as much as her dad does, but they both use this. This is the computer I built for them, and over the last three or four months, this thing started having arguments. Now, this is running MX18.2 Continuum. Um, you can see there I've got two hard drives in it. This is the one that we had to overhaul the power supply on. And it's been fine, but now it's starting to have a bit of a dummy spin. And I don't know yet whether it's motherboard, whether it's MX Linux, whether it's a specific component on the motherboard, like the chipset or the CPU, maybe it could be RAM. What happens with this is uh, you'll be using it and then the screen will just go black. So I don't actually know what's caused this to... Um, stuff up so I've got to look at this as well the other project I've got on for today is the poor man's repair video on this I'm waiting for the part to rock up it will be here today but unfortunately and I know this from experience uh, being Australia Post it may not get here till very late this afternoon so we could be doing this into tonight friday night although actually i can't because i'm going out tonight for a birthday celebration so i'm hoping this gets here middle of the day and i can get this thing done so that's what's on the cards for me today <laughs> and um I, i'm just hoping this rocks up so i can get this done and get it all fixed up today so we will have a combined unboxing video and a poor man's repair video in one video. Now, the other thing I'm doing as well, 